Welcome to World Action and Reaction News, before starting today's news, my request to all dear friends please press like button if this information is useful for you and also hit the subscribe button along with bell icon for future news updates, let's start today's news. Indian Space Research Organization, IRO, will launch its latest remote sensing satellite of the Kartaza 2 series, along with 28 foreign satellites riding piggyback, only in the first week of January, a top IRO official said. Director of Thiruvananthapuram based Vikram Sarabhai Space Center, VSSC, K7 clarified that there will be no launch this month and that launch services, which halted after the unsuccessful launch of navigation satellite Irans 1H on August 31st, will resume in the first week of the new year. Rakesh Sasibushan, CMD of Antriksh, IRO's commercial arm, told Toy, the January launch payload will comprise a combination of one Kartasat, 25 nano satellites, and three microsatellites. Finland is the new customer this time. The rest co passengers are from existing foreign customers. Most of these small satellites are from the US. The launch of Kartasat 2 by the PSLV C 40 rocket is a follow on mission of the Kartasat 2 series with the primary objective of providing high resolution scene specific spot imageries. The satellite, which carries panchromatic and multispectral cameras, is capable of delivering high-resolution data. Sivan said, after the Kartasat mission, the subsequent launch will be of JSAT 6A that will be lifted off by a GSLV MK2 rocket. The launch of navigation satellite Irans 1I, which will replace the first navigation satellite Irans 1A, whose three atomic clocks, meant to provide precise locational data, had stopped working last year. Is planned in February or March, he said, adding, next in line will be the Chandrayaan 2 mission, scheduled for launch in March. The series of satellite launches scheduled next year is in line with IRO Chairman A.S. Kiran Kumar's recent statement to Toy that the space agency is planning to double the number of launches from 8 to 10 to 18 to 20 annually. Kiran Kumar also said that though the space agency currently has 45 satellites in orbit, the country is significantly short of communication satellites. Therefore we have to maximize launches.